hello everyone and in this video we will do the match preview of india versus south africa first odi so are you excited if you are excited so please give us a like and subscribe to our channel for more videos like this so let us come out to come on to our main topic which is to preview the match let us talk about first the venue the venue will be the boland park in ba pal and now let us come to the live telecasting so the live telecasting rights on tv is given to star sports network and if you want to watch this match on mobile phone so you can download hotstar app right now and uh, to after two days you can watch the match on hotstar and if you have already downloaded hotstar so you can watch this match live so now let us come to the playing 11 of both the teams so let us talk about india's playing 11 so india's playing 11 will be opener kl rahul he'll open with shikhar dhawan ruturaj gaikwad will not get the chance in this first odi because it's uh, it's difficult south africa is very difficult it's a very difficult country to bat in cause the ball always swings and it is and it has uh, a good pace and bounce so uh, it will be you know, not be very easy for gaikwad though he has scored runs in the vijay hazar trophy he has scored few hundreds a good ones uh, and shikhar dhawan has been bad in the vijay hazar trophy but he shikhar dhawan gets experience which ruturaj gaikwad doesn't have this is ruturaj gaikwad's debut one day series he has made his t20 debut in sri lanka but he has not made his odi debut so the two openers will be kl rahul and shikhar dhawan number 3 virat kohli who he is not the skipper for this odi series the captain for this series will be kl rahul he he is a good captain and uh, he has been captaining punjab kings for 2 years he was the captain for punjab kings in 2020 and 2021 so he can be the captain uh, uh, sorry he is the captain in this series number 4 shreyas ayer shreyas ayer is also a experienced player not too much but more, he has more experience than surya kumar yadav Sure uh, instead of Yadav Shreyas will bat at 4 because South Africa I said is difficult and India in, in the first ODI India will try uh, to play with the their experienced players and in the second or third if uh, in the first ODI if the experienced player doesn't perform Shikhar Dhawan or uh, Shreyas Iyer so Ruturaj Gaikwad can play in place of Dhawan and uh, and Shuri Kumar Yadav can play in place of Ayer. Number five, Rishabh Pant, India's wicketkeeper batsman. Number six, Venkatesh Ayer, who can make his debut in this ODI series. Uh, in this first ODI match only, he can make his debut. because of his all round performance in uh, in IPL 2021 according to his IPL performance on the basis of his IPL performance he
he has selected in India squad and now in the first ODI he can make his debut. Hardik Pandya is not available and uh, Ravinder Jadeja too. So India needed a uh, all rounder like Pandya who can bat at six and bowl a few overs. If Hardik Pandya would also be available, but he could uh, he would not bowl uh, he would not bowl in the match. So that's why. Venkatesh Ayer is better all rounder than Hardik Pandya. I don't think I think that Hardik Pandya is no. I don't. I think that he is no longer an all rounder. He has. He is a number six batsman, a finisher. I think only a finisher. Me that means because he doesn't bowl. He bowls very less, very 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 less. So that's why. Venkatesh Iyer is a better option than Hardik Pandya. Number seven will be our bowling all rounder, our new bowling all rounder, Shardul Thakur. He has impressed with the bat and played a little cameos for India at number seven or eight. So that's why Shardul Thakur you know, has got the opportunity. To play in this One Day International against South Africa at Boland Park. Number eight, Bhuvneshwar Kumar, the swing bowler for Team India, moved the ball both ways. Uh, if it's in swing or out swing, Bhuvneshwar Kumar is very good at it. Number nine, Navdeep Saini or Mohammad Siraj. If Siraj isn't injured then he can play but if he is injured so uh, Navdeep Saini will play in place of him because he didn't also played uh, th the third test due to his injury he got a hamstring uh, in the second test if uh, he play because we have not got no news if he uh, if his hamstring is little a little better, so he can play. Otherwise, Navdeep Saini, who was selected as a as a, uh, a replacement for Mohammad Siraj, can play in this match. And if Navdeep Saini will also not play, India has an an another option who moves the ball like Bhuvneshwar Kumar and has. The ability to swing uh, uh, inside of the batsman and outside of the batsman, which is Deepak Chahar. If Siraj is not injured, he'll definitely play in this match. But if he is injured, so anyone between Navdeep Saini or uh, uh, or Deepak Chahar can play in this ODI. Number ten, Jaspreet Bumrah. A fast bowler, a great fast bowler for Team India. Number eleven, India needed a spinner, so they have got Yuzi in the squad. So Yuzvendra Chahal will play at number eleven. This was India's playing eleven. But now let's come on to South Africa's playing eleven. The openers will be Janeman Milan and Quinton de Kock. Both will open. Milan has got a very good uh, average in one day international and has scored 177 against Netherlands. That's a very good score. So he'll open with de Kock. And number three, Aiden Markram. Number four, Rassi van der Dusen. Number five, their captain, Temba Babuma. Number six, uh, they'll go with their experienced middle order batsman, David Miller. Number seven, uh, they'll go with Andilo Filicuayo, who will make uh, who will make a comeback in uh, in uh, uh, for South Africa in international cricket. Number 
نمبر ایٹ کگیزو رباڑا نمبر نائن مارکو ینسن ویری گڈ لیفٹ آم پیسر دیئر بالنگ ول لک ویری گڈ گڈ ساؤتھ افریقہ شمزی رباڑا مارکو ینسن مارکو ینسن ہیز ٹیکن نائنٹین وکٹس اگینسٹ انڈیا ان دا ٹیسٹ سیریز اینڈ رباڑا ہیز ٹیکن ٹوینٹی مارکو ینسن از اے گریٹ یگ لیفٹ آرم پیسر اینڈ رباڑا از اے ویری گڈ ایوری بڈی نوز نو نیڈ ٹو ٹیل دیٹ ہی از اے ویری گڈ ایکسپیرینس پیسر فار ساؤتھ افریقہ ہو ہیڈ پلیڈ فرام اے فیو ایئرس ہو از بین پلیئنگ فار اے فیو ایئرس ہی از اے گڈ پیسر اینڈ نمبر ٹین تربریس شمزی ورلڈ نمبر ون ٹی ٹوینٹی بولر ٹی ٹوینٹی اسپنر ٹی ٹوینٹی نو اوور آل آئی کین سے بیکاز اٹس راشد خان بٹ ان رینکنگ ہی از دا بیسٹ ٹی ٹوینٹی اسپنر اکارڈنگ ٹو آل دا ٹی ٹوینٹی لیگس اٹس راشد خان بٹ ان دا آئی سی سی ٹی ٹوینٹی رینکنگ تربریس شمزی از آن دا ٹاپ اینڈ ہی از اے گریٹ لیگ اسپنر فار ساؤتھ افریقہ ہو آلسو پرفارم ان ون ڈے انٹرنیشنلس نمبر الیون دے آر گون ود ان اگین ود اگین ایکسپیرینس پلیئر وچ از لنگی انگیڈی انگیڈی سو دس واز دا پلیئنگ الیون فار بوتھ آف دا ٹیمس لاؤ لیٹ می میک سم پریڈکشنس مائی پریڈکشن فرسٹ پریڈکشن از وننگ پریڈکشن which will be the team who will bat second can win this match because the pal pitch is getting slower and slower by the day so that my prediction is the team who uh, who is going to bowl first is going to win the match second prediction is the team who will win the match now in this i have to uh, tell one or the others is south africa or india after the toss i can know who can win the match but before toss i can't know so i think i think south africa can win this match indian fans don't get angry because uh, it'll be uh, it is south african conditions and you saw that how uh, how south africa managed to win the second and the third test so that's why i'm going with south africa to win this match and if india gets the opportunity uh, to bowl first then they have the they have, can win 65% and if south africa gets the opportunity to bowl first so they can win 85 percent uh, 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 now my second prediction is who can be the uh, who can perform well between chahal and shamzi i can say shamzi again because of home conditions and now a um, uh, uh, third is that which captain to score more runs kl rahul or temba bumuma this time i'm going with kl rahul Fourth is that which wicket keeper to score more runs, Quinton de Kock or Rishabh Pant? I'm go, I'll go with Quinton de Kock because he bats in the top order and Rishabh Pant bats at number six. He can finish oh, at number five, sorry, in the one days. He can finish the game, Rishabh Pant, but he can't uh, score runs if India will be in trouble and he'll come before ten overs. I don't want this to be done that uh, 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 to lose three wickets in the power play. But if he'll come before 10 overs, then I think that uh, Rishabh Pant can score. But Quinton de Kock, I think, can score more runs than Rishabh Pant. Uh, fifth prediction is that who will score more runs between the all-rounders, Andalo Filiquayo or Venkatesh Iyer. I think Venkatesh Iyer because he bats at number 6 and Filiquayo bats at number 7. Now, 
my the last my last prediction is that will virat kohli make a century in this odi match or the series i can't say he'll make the century in this odi match but i can say that he'll make uh, his uh, turn in this series i can't say but i'm not sure that virat kohli will make that turn nobody is sure but i think that 100 will come after 2 years this can be possible so i'm ending the video here hope you enjoyed the video subscribe to our channel like this video bye bye